similarities between the wing on an aeroplane and the wing on the uh, America's Cup yacht is they're trying to make lift force, a large amount of force, which either lifts the plane up in the air or pushes the boat forward. There's challenges for each one that are a little bit different, but the primary goal, make a lot of force to get the boat going fast or the plane in the air, is exactly the same. On the Oracle Team USA boat, the wing is controlled by the wing trimmer. He's a guy who actually holds the rope that rotates the wing and as you pull that rope on, the wing develops more and more force. Pull it on too much and the boat will tip over, let it go and the boat goes flat and stops moving. The winglet on the end of an Airbus wing creates better efficiency for the wing so that it actually appears like a longer wing which is desirable when you're uh, trying to lift heavy loads with a wing. The winglet on the dagger boards underneath our boat has a completely different function. That's actually to produce vertical lift to lift the boat up out of the water. There's a lot of similarities between what Jimmy Spithill's doing with the boat as a pilot would do flying a plane. Um, the vertical lift of how you actually lift the boat up out of the water is just like takeoff for an aeroplane. Similarly, when you turn the boat, you've got to bank it as well as actually change direction. It's exactly the same as flying a plane. And Jimmy, uh, I think probably you all know, has uh, now got his pilot's license and is uh, training to become a, a more and more proficient pilot, which he claims makes him a better skipper. Maybe one day he'll be hired by Airbus as a pilot then. <laughs> I hope so. I'd feel pretty good with him flying the plane as long as I was hanging on.